Hey you guys and welcome back to Rim Games for another episode of The Rim Worlds. Right where we left off in the last video. Following the last recording, we've got some visitors. I'm waiting for Edward to wake up before I go check to see if I can trade with him. If they have metal, I want all of it. All of it ever. Edward, come on, you're a night owl. You and all. Why is Satan awake and Edward isn't? Ain't gonna be happy about it being like freaking daytime. Alright, Edward. How's your character doing? Almost there on rest. Alright, who's the other social? Cameron Sweeney. You need to trade. Boom. Any metal. I got a shoddy sniper rifle. Tempting. But I mean, if we look at the stats here, it's only 70% accuracy. 40 damage, though. I might. I'm going to sell the PDW, since we're not using it, I don't know why we're not using it. It's normal. First shot of three, does five damage each. And we're going to buy the sniper rifle and give it to our best shot. Which so happens to be... you. I don't really want the assault right or the sniper rifle right now while you're you hunt right. Satan. Just making sure it was Satan. Yeah Satan's a hunter. I don't really want them hunting with the sniper rifle. Too good to waste. Got quite a bit of warm up, but what I'm gonna do is I'm going to turn this all into a building. Put those supports there just in case anything happens. I don't want anything to happen. Will anything happen? Not likely. But just in case. This should all become enclosed. We don't have a no home zone. Oh, what am I doing? Sorry, we don't have any roof zone except for right here, which I can clear out. We've already dealt with that. Do you have enough wood to do all this? Hopefully. Obviously, there's no trees over there that we can harvest, just in case we don't. But yet, he's going to get right on that, which is great. It means we've somewhat caught up on our priorities. That one tree gave us 60, which is wonderful. So we definitely have the wood for it. I'm gonna queue those, those up for deconstruction too. Want to haul all the metal on the map? I know, I'm setting them up for like a ton of things and we still have all this steel out here. But they'll get that done. I'm sure of it. Trade caravan that was here is leaving. Fine. Everything's indoors. 
do we have we have the metal to make a steam geyser so we're gonna do that we're gonna want the thermal the the thing all right I'm gonna want the thing I'm gonna wire it up properly so I can be happy about it put a power conduit all the way out here they should get to building that right away once we get that power, I'll reactivate the lamps, which do cover most of these two things. Not very beautiful, but I mean, we do have the metal for it now. We have plenty of components. 80, that's fine. Still volcanic winter. And then once we get everything hauled and stuff, I might even do that off camera. I don't know. It's really hard to do things off camera in this game because of the random events and raids and stuff like that. We have visitors. Has a couple items to trade. Isn't a total pleb from the caveman era. We will check with him as he comes through. I need to get him a work schedule. Average was there and you get eight hours of sleep. Have your joy there, and you get nine hours of sleep. Let's put your joy back, because that was a misclick. All this was a misclick. Jesus. All right, there we go. That's how I'm going to work him. Specifically, he will work up until 5 a.m. Do some stuff. He'll go to sleep at 8 a.m., wake up at 4 p.m.? Kinda of shitty, actually. Well, we'll be doing stuff at night more, anyways. That's at least nine hours of sleep. Probably enough. I don't know specifically what they take. Where is Edward? I need you to trade with these people before they go away. Simple meal, fine meal. You can sell the sniper rifle. I'm gonna keep the the pilas. Non reusable throwing spears. Pretty sure they don't run out, they just lose their ability eventually. Don't care about the chocolate. We could sell our simple meals, but let's not. Another thing I'm going to do is I'm going to fix the... I'm going to manage areas. Uh, I'm going to delete that actually. New animal area. Rename this to... Um... Animals usual, and I'm gonna rename this to uh, animal events. The difference is going to be animal event is going to be just our base, basically. No pun intended. It's just. It's literally going to be our base. That's the only place that they're allowed to go during this event. Inside of our base areas. So during that time they won't be able to use the doors, they won't be able to do any of that. 
than the usual. I'm just going to get lazy with it. Is our base on steroids? Because they'll be able to go anywhere in the base. As well as outside around our base. Now, what makes this different than a home zone? Probably not a lot. Uh, clear to law area, let's make this a little bit smaller. That might make it a little bit different from a home zone. It's a little bit smaller than our home zone. I don't want them going all the way out here and stuff. So animal usual, they can go like uh, out over here. Actually, I don't want them anywhere near this bear. Just in case it like decides to attack something. That's fine. In the meantime, animals usual. That dude's leaving. Is he any good? Could have like captured him, I guess. Really good at shooting. How's our food doing? 20 meals, like 500 meat. We're good. We don't need to hunt those deer for a while. Our power's starting to get back up there. It's not the greatest. We can at least uh, turn these two lights on. Cameron Sweeney's gonna do that. They were going to increase this. Just spend that. I remember what I wanted the wood for. I wanted to make a wood sculptor's table. I'm gonna put a few of our other things in here. Get ourselves like some artist working. Make sure no one else can do art things. Even though Yeti is like really good at it. I did not want to make a steel dining chair. What was that sound? A bear didn't just like eat something of ours, did it? May have bit like a turtle or something, I don't know. There's two bears, that's worrying. If we can get enough metal and stuff, then I'm going to make another geothermal generator outputting 3600 watts. It's actually filling us up pretty good. I can probably afford to turn these back on. Really stupid that plants sleep at night. There's a mod out there to fix that. I don't know if I would or not. Like it treats the plants kind of like a, an entity that has to sleep at night. I don't know how I feel about that yet. People will get back to eat. People will start making all the stuff. Cameron Sweeney is going to fix out the cooking situation. Window water is going to start doing that. This is done, so I'm going to add a bill to make large sculptures.
out of literally just uh, stone blocks. There's no reason to use anything else, to be honest. Especially when we have so many stone blocks. I should really focus that out of like sandstone. In fact, I'm going to do just that. Let's do just sandstone. What kind of floors are these? Limestone. That's fine. Two floors. Move the limestone in. Make this all a little bit better. When your auto doors stopped working, you have to improve it with. All of our stuff is just breaking down, which is really dumb. Prioritize replacing that. The auto door is not that big of a deal, it just takes a couple seconds extra to open. Probably won't even notice it. I don't know why that limestone is dramatically different. I honestly don't care either. Oh, it's because there's a stockpile on it. That's why. Fix all the wooden flooring that we may oh. may or may not have. Let's do some wood flooring here. All this is already wood anyways. Two hundred and fifty two wood for that. Or I could just do limestone. We might be able to finish the base with limestone. Probably not though. I don't like that it can overwrite floors that already has floors. right here has wooden floor. Eduardo is going to constantly work on some large structures. Get us some trading advantages. In the meantime, that'll make his art better. Got a passion for it, so... Goes up at a decent rate. Spring has begun and we're still in a volcanic winter. It's pretty crazy. They do appear to have gotten all the metal. You have 610. Plenty-ish of power. I mean, we do have a surplus. That's good. You construct a few of these walls here. We don't really need them. I might do something about the fact that the beacon is surrounded by that wall at some point, but... Ugh. Slowly get all the stuff built. Right. So I forgot that you could do campfires all together until I saw someone else's video and I just like about died. True story. I was minimally freaking out because I'm like, that's a thing. And yeah. 
set up two more heaters. If we keep it at a pretty low temperature, but enough to keep the plants growing, then that'll be good. They're all building out, which is nice. It's nice to have that stockpile so close. Ooh, I need to stay awake. I have a live stream to be doing in like half an hour ish. Might be late though, because of food. Oh, uh, this is also for prisoners. And these are medical. So you can have sick people around you if you're just a single prisoner with sick people around. It says a lot of work left, but it'll eventually be done. Could probably get away with doing the smaller statues, but I don't care. And they did get some of the clean gun, that's nice. Who's idle? Nobody at the moment. We haven't had a raid in a long time. I haven't even used those walls that I added to the game. No reason, just haven't felt like messing around with building things. Cancel all this. Alright, but this video has gone on for a little bit. So thank you guys for watching. Remember to stay positive. I'll see you guys in the next video. Maybe we'll kill these bears. I don't know. I don't even know where the bears went. One of them. Oh, we found them. Get the camera. Anyways, bye bye.